Hey guys, what is going on? It is me, Aiden, again with another Maple Story commentary slash gameplay. And as you can see in the background, I was on my hero, not my hero, thinking too far ahead, but I was on my fighter, basically just walking through Pyreon, just killing everything to do with Pyreon, <laughs> different type of monsters, stumps, you know, junior boogies, you know, killing everything, just, you know, just, just, just to fit in with the theme of what I'm going to be talking about in this video and what I'm going to be talking about in this video is my class, my favorite class, you know, the class I've always felt connected to and the, basically a background and explanation of why I love the class so much and that class is obviously something to do with Pyreon, it is a warrior class, it is the fighter, crusader and hero class. The reason why I love this class so much, I don't know why, it's, it was always kind of like a long-standing, I guess you could say a long-standing relationship between us, me and that class. It's kind of like, when I when I first ever started, I'm going to say the first the first time I ever played MapleStory, the first ever character I created was a warrior, and I, I kind of just made it because, well, I thought, why not? I mean, heroes, they have, I mean, not heroes, but like, swordsmen, they have swords, that's pretty cool, it's pretty badass, you know, it just looks really awesome and I just thought why not because it looks really cool and on my first ever character I actually made like nine, a 19 in warrior and that's pretty fell but I know I know a lot of you guys have probably done that but uh yeah and I remember the first time I ever and by the way the first time I ever hit on my second hit second job on a character was on a fighter actually it was funny because I remember this back in 2005 2006 uh, me and my friend uh, we, we, we were doing it at the same time the advancement you know he's like he's like to me oh Aiden what, which job which job has hyper body I'm like um the fighter class and then obviously that's obviously fighters don't have hyper body or maybe you can get it nowadays with the you know decent skills and stuff like that but uh yeah then I actually accidentally told him and he accidentally became a fighter and you know it was kind of it was a kind of a way of fate, I guess you could say, because, you know, after that, like, I, he stopped playing it, and he told me, like, oh, you know, I'm going to make the Spearman, just keep playing the fighter class, and, you know, after I kept playing that, it was kind of, it was really fun, I just really enjoyed it, even though this was pre bang, it was really hard to level, you know, I kind of still enjoyed it, and that's the reason why I still play the class today, like, I remember, well, I met, I've made so many fighters in the past, I've made so many fighters, I've made, like, I've ha I have one Crusader in Windia, I have, I had a, a hacked hero in, in Broa, and, you know, I ha I've had a lot of other fighters, and I remember, like, back in, like, Carnival PQ, you know, Monster Carnival, you know, I'd, like, go to, like, get to, like, level 50, and I'd dominate all the Rombots and stuff, and, you know, it was just awesome to be a fighter, and, you know, you'd always be on the top of everything, and another thing about the fighter class, that fighter, you know, Crusader, hero class, is, I'll call it the hero class, because I guess that kind of sounds cool, and it kind of sounds what it's supposed to be. But I remember like ages ago uh, on internet, on the internet, I watched on YouTube a video of a guy, of a hero, a really famous hero, I don't know if you guys know him, but his name is Crouton, I don't think he plays anymore, but his video was amazing, man, like I was just awestruck, and then from that moment I knew that I was going to be a hero, and if I ever get a class level 200, I know it will be a hero, and that's why I was stuck with the class for so, for so long, because that... Because that video I watched of Crouton, uh, I think I believe it's called the Hero's Path. It was so amazing, and it was like it, it hooked me onto the class, and I knew that from then on I was gonna play that class for a very long time, and I, I, I knew I was gonna enjoy it, and I just I knew I was gonna be stuck with that class. And it's funny because you know every time I try to, try to play a different class, it's kind of strange because you know everyone says that warriors you know are you know boring slow not fun at all but for me personally when i'm playing the hero class it's it's really fun and i, I don't know why like i just it, it's not the fact that anymore it's not the fact anymore that i i liked having swords it's just that when i play i don't find it boring it's it's kind of strange because you know people nowadays are all into the flashy classes and stuff like that but you know everyone it's like everyone's into their own class you know if you know it might not just be might not might not just be one class it might be like a hot like a whole like for example you might be like bowmen so you might pick like wild hunters you know what like wild hunters um uh, uh hunters you know crossbowmen Mercedes, you know, you just might be connected to those branch of classes, and it's just that one thing you've been addicted to, you know, in a way, I guess you could say, and it may sound weird, you know, but I've, I've really, I've really just, I really love the hero class and everything about it, because another thing, I remember watching, uh, you know, Vicados, everyone knows Vicados, 
on YouTube and his videos are awesome. It's just that every time I go on YouTube and I watch hero videos, it's just so inspirational, man. I just really like want to play the class. And But let me reiterate, man, that Crouton's video is amazing. If you guys haven't seen it, it's so underrated. It is such a good video. It goes for like eight, like eight or ten minutes, but it is so good. It was pre-bang 2007, I think it was recorded. But I just, when, after watching that video, I was just like, I looked down. I'm like, wow, man, that was amazing. Like, I know from that, I knew from that moment that hero, the hero class was my class, and I'm probably never ever gonna stop playing it, and probably get it to level 200 one day. Hopefully, I don't know, maybe. But if I ever get a class to level 200, I know it will be the hero class. And you know, it's just that I've always felt I've had the connection to it, and I've also felt I've had a connection to Pyrion, man, because Pyrion is awesome, man. I just love like the BGM, and you know, it kind of like bangs in between, you know, the hero class and, you know, being like, like, de like, freaking like, some mountains and stuff, you know, like, manly and stuff like that, it kind of like, all goes into the, you know, the creating of the class and it kind of fits in with the theme of the warrior and, you know, basically what I'm just trying to say is that I love the hero class and, you know, I know you guys probably have classes that you like, you know, leave those in the comments, you know, because everyone has their own personal favorite class and, you know, I'm really interested to hear what is your favorite class, or, you know, bran branch of classes, because, you know, it's it's really interesting, it's, it's a really interesting subject, I guess you could say, but, uh, yeah, I love the hero class, that's basically what I'm trying to say, but, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll be seeing you guys next time, peace.